We are talking about sprucing up your beauty routine, hopefully seasonally, and we're going to find out why. So I'm joined by Grace Gold. She is a beauty and wellness expert. Thank you for joining us. Thanks for having me, Jordan. So tell us why it is so important to change up our beauty and wellness routine on a seasonal basis. So I guess every three to four months. Why is that important? Exactly. You know, taking care of your overall well-being, it can look very different in the winter time versus the springtime. And a good routine can really help us achieve our goals. But for that routine to be effective, it has to be flexible. And that includes adjusting for the weather. And now is really the perfect time to revamp those self-care routines as our goals change with the season to embrace a, a, fresh, a fresh start, which I think we all need more than ever. Oh, totally. I mean, as the, when spring comes, you think of spring cleaning, right? Your home and the area around you, but you don't necessarily think about it for yourself sometimes, right? You got to change that up. So if we want to get started on changing it up, how do we do that? Where do we start? Yes, well, you want to start with skin because skin, of course, is the largest organ in our body, and it is so important to nourish it year round. Rich moisture means advanced exfoliation for velvety smooth skin with Olay's premium exfoliating body wash collection. Now, this is crafted by Olay body skin experts to include natural ingredients like vitamin B3 complex and massage away those dead skin cells to improve skin without drying it out. Now, I love that it comes in three great options, sugar and cocoa butter. They've got deep sea minerals and coconut water. And my personal favorite, the pink Himalayan salt and pink grapefruit, which just smells so amazing and helped me wake um, up this morning as well. well I'm, a, I'm a coconut girl, so I'd be all over that one. And yeah, when you say get away the dead skin, yes, please. We want a nice tan, even tan as we're going into spring and summer, right? So do you have any other tips? What else do you have there? Exactly. <laughs> Yes, well, we all know when spring is in full bloom, so is allergy season, unfortunately, mm -hmm. and a big part of looking your best is feeling your best, but if you're one of the millions of Americans suffering from sinus problems, you especially know that's true. Mucinex Sinus Max, it's really a game changer, especially in the spring season. This helps temporarily relieve symptoms like sinus congestion, headaches, and sinus pressure with just one dose or your money back. That way you can actually get outside and enjoy the season. And you want to remember to use this as directed. And finally, in the springtime, many of us take up new exercise routines. We're out in the garden. We're tackling those home improvement projects. And strains from tasks like these, especially after a winter of inactivity can cause sore muscles and back pain. And that's where Arnicare can help. It's a non-greasy, unscented, plant-powered gel that quickly absorbs into your skin to relieve muscle pain and stiffness. I love that it also helps reduce discoloration from bruises, which is great when those Ooh. summer fashion trends show off a little more skin so you can feel more confident as well. <laughs> Of course. And you know what? I will admit since the pandemic hit, I am actually big into working out. I have basically done nothing since the pandemic. So if I start having achy, achy soreness muscles, you know, I'm going to be going for that for sure. So if people want to find more about these products, where can they go? Sure. You can visit any of these on their website pages. Again, I talked about Olay, Mucinex, and Arnicare. Okay. Looking forward to trying some of that, especially that uh, exfoliating coconut smelling body wash. That seems really nice. Well, thank you so much for your time. I'm excited for the new season ahead. Yep. Happy spring, Jordan. Happy spring. And if you want to see this segment again or get more information, go to firstcoastliving.net.